I don't know if you guys can see this screen, but I'm going to show you exactly, see if you can see the date on this, to the date six months later, the change. So you're going to first see the first video my husband did six months ago, and now I'm going to do a quick walkthrough on his garden exactly what it looked like six months ago before the wood chips. Now I'm in the same spot that you just saw that was exactly to the day six months ago in March, middle of March, to the day. I won't be able to do the exact walkthrough because there's so much growth in here now. But here is the cinder block wall that you could see before. And then he's got all the rebar that all the UBs are growing on, the purple yams. That wasn't here. Six months ago, he did a video, so he was going to drag in all the wood chips and get everything set up. Now the rebar. And if you saw before, the banana plants look like nothing. Here's the back part of the cinder blocks. And there's my husband walking through with his camera because he he did the video from six months ago. And like I said, I can't do the same exact walkthrough because there's just so much growth. But I just wanted to show in six months, he brought in all these wood chips that were not here. These were not here. It was dry dirt this dry clay and he brought in all the wood chips to change the growth on all the plants he was putting in here and look what the wood chips did I mean this is amazing and keep in mind all these purple yams they would never have been able to grow in the soil that we have here never but he set this up six months ago, and I just wanted to show you a before and after. And this is six months. I don't know what it'll look like in another six months, but this is amazing. So that's it. I'm trying to walk with my camera and not fall over anything. I mean, just check it and check out the video from six months. So has everything broken down on the ground yet? No. This is continual. Once you lay wood chips down, it's continual. It's constantly breaking down and feeding the soil, feeding the microbes, feeding the plants. It's, it's a forever constant thing. Do you know how many inches or what you've got here? Gary? Is, if you look over here, this is about two feet. My oh, that's right, the sweet potatoes, too. Two feet. So you've got two feet, and as you walk on it, it will turn into like a fine dust, and it will slowly drift down. As you water it, it gets further down under the ground. This will be a good example. Okay.
Look at the soil. To think our soil is this light gray. Grain fruit, grain fruit beetle larvae, earthworms. Look at that. That's that, just amazing. That is amazing. Look at that. This would be, nothing here would be older than a year old because that's when I planted the bananas. So this is one year of breaking down and it's just going to break down forever and constantly break down yeah. and feed. This is the greatest topsoil. It smells beautiful. So now you saw before and after in one year, no, six months, I was going to say one year. Six months, Gary, because you didn't, you yeah, brought six, this in six, six months. months. You said one year, six months. Yeah, six months. Six months. He misspoke. I didn't misspoke. Okay, he misspoke. So it's not one year. That's six months of breaking down because he did the video that you just saw when he was getting ready to start bringing in the wood chips to this area. It was yeah. just all dirt. I forgot. I planted the bananas a year ago, but brought the wood chips in six months ago. Okay, so now you, you get to see the before and after, and that's just too cool. And now we're going to have bananas, we're going to have ubies, sweet potatoes, all that. Oh my goodness. Real quick, before I shut this off, what is this? That's um, taro. Cool. That's the green taro. Green taro. And I, want that... to, I want to get the purple, but this is the green. And that sweet potato growing on the ground? Sweet around? potato, yeah. You They're leave good. a little piece in the ground and it just comes back. Growing everywhere. All right. Before and after. Six months. Not one year, people. Six months. This is amazing. That's what I'm saying. You can break this stuff down so quick. It doesn't have to take years. Even Paul Gauchi has said, drop it and plant in it. His back to Eden gardening is just gorgeous. It, you don't have to wait. If you can get wood chips, drop it, start watering it, and then just get ready and start your garden. Well, everybody, have a great day, and don't forget to eat what you grow.